Sean. Hey, Molly. Where's TJ? Still sleeping. It's past noon. Yeah, I know. He talked me into this little compromise. He said if he had to spend the day studying, the least I can do is let him sleep in. Figure it wasn't worth the fight. But you're right, though. You should go wake him up. Especially since he's got a friend here. Be right back, okay? Okay. All right. You get settled. I'll look at you something to eat. You want the usual? Yes, please. With nope. extra ketchup. Of course. Well, it's late enough. You got work to do. Hey, Hey. How you doing? Great. Hey. Hey. So I was thinking we could start with history, if that's okay with you. I'd rather start with a bagel and some cream cheese. So if you wanted breakfast, you should have gotten up before noon. Well, I didn't. I'm tired, and now I'm hungry. And that's why I got you these, because I figured you might be. Thank you. What is this? It's a garden burger. Oh. It's okay. I think I'm going to get a real burger. No, uh, no. You're going to eat what's put in front of you. Okay, I'm gonna let you guys figure out the food thing and I'm gonna go to work. Love you, I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Bye. Roosevelt was elected president in 1901, after McKinley was assassinated. You might as well try it. It's close to the real thing anyway. If it's that close, why not just get the real thing? Really? Do you have any idea what's involved in making ground beef? How they treat those poor animals? Well, it's inhumane, not to mention disgusting. Really? They're cows. They're living, breathing animals. I just watched a documentary on the whole process, how it all works. It honestly made me never want to eat meat again. I've actually been thinking about starting a school club to raise awareness about the issue. An anti-beef club? Where you do what? Sit around and eat tofu? No, we'd petition the school board to offer healthier alternatives on campus. And beef wouldn't be the only issue. Have you seen the vending machines? Nothing but sugar. Isn't that kind of the point of a vending machine? No! I think we should be putting our resources towards a school garden. That way we could teach kids about sustainability while helping them make informed choices about what they eat and where. So you're telling me that you want to take away all the vending machines, sodas, candies, and make people plant carrots in their free period instead? I'm sorry, but that's pretty whack. A lot of school systems have already started doing it. You'd be surprised. Let me know which ones, so I'll make sure I don't end up there. And you wonder why you only have five my face friends. You know, that wasn't very nice, especially considering I'm just trying to help you. What am I, your hobby? Since you have nothing else to do with your life? You're reading Catcher in the Rye? Supposed to be. Haven't started it yet. Well, it's, um, it's a really good book. I think you'd like it. Main character actually reminds me a lot of you. Why? You tell me. Do you really want to help me? Convince Sean to get me a tablet computer so I don't have to carry all these stupid books around. How about you show him you deserve one by getting good grades? Why don't you read through the first few pages while I look over the study questions? <clears throat> there. Done. Wait, really? Okay, what did you think of the Smith character? Seems pretty chill. TJ, there is no Smith character. You got me. I didn't read it. Because you can't, right? You can't read. 